Hi. Now we have sound. I had a previous video, no sound. Oh my goodness. All right, here we go. We're doing a review. Um, of the automatic espresso maker made by Philips. There are others that are with a, t a different brand names um, that cost twice as much. So I found this, there was only a German review on it. So I wanted to make an English one. I just finished making the latte macchiato. Have a look at it. Look at it for the darkness of the coffee and the beauty of the milk here. Uh, here is a cappuccino, all right? Um, I'm just going to make you, right now I'm going to make a coffee. Actually, let's make a, uh, huh, don't have quite enough milk in here, so I'm going to have to fill her up here, okay? Just a moment. really easy to fill up so you just take the lid off this comes out and okay so I'm just going to make a cappuccino so you can get the idea all right Automatic and press. Beautiful dark espresso, isn't it? Fantastic. Crema, 15 bar pressure. And by the way, this is actually hot. So uh, we had another um, espresso maker and it just never got hot enough. Even when we pre-warmed the cups, et cetera, et cetera, this is actually hot. So here we go. That's your cappuccino. Beautiful, isn't it? European size, not American size, you know, that fills the cup. It would fill a normal coffee cup halfway. All right. So there you go. That's the cappuccino. Now I'm just gonna review everything again here. This is where water goes. There is a water tank. Um, like I was saying, I do use a measuring cup and I just pour the water in here so I'm not having to pull. Uh, there's a plastic handle. And let me just turn this a bit so you can see. It's a bit flimsy, right? So I try to leave it in there. I just pour the water in. In here is where your coffee beans go. Okay, now it looks like we have a stray bean that's kind of stuck somewhere here. There we go. Um, so here's where the beans go in. All right. Um, in here, so if you're wanting to make decaf, put it in there and into this little hole, close it, and you can make somebody a decaf. All right. Um, let's see, I will open this door here again. Um, you do get lubricant 
okay? That um, to you can pull this out. So if you're doing a thorough cleaning and you need to lubricate bits and pieces, um, you can do that from here, okay? I'm not gonna do that right now. Um, then, let's see. So I've made cappuccino. I'm gonna take the milk off, put it in the fridge, let's say, right? Or if you're wanting to clean it, everything comes apart easily and you can clean this entire thing. But for now, I've still got some milk in there, so I'm gonna put it in the fridge. Okay, now one other thing. Again, these coffees are so good. I have to have another sip. So that's the cappuccino. Mmm. And hot. This is the latte macchiato. Okay. Mmm. That's a nice smooth one. This cappuccino is quite strong. And this is a mix of espresso and cappuccino. That's how I got the cup so full. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Okay. Um, now, and you can also make coffee. Really, that's an espresso with water added to it. Okay, that's pretty simple. Uh, coffee, so Americano. You would know that as Americano. So I'm going to... I'm um, just trying to get an angle here so you can see, all right? I'm going to take the tray out the bottom, all right? This is interesting, I think. So there's two buttons you press. Okay, now I've, I'm going to have to do it this way. <laughs> it's odd filming. Um, okay, here we go. So you'll notice, see, the, um, it's automatic. It's telling me that something's open, right? So I just open this because what I want to show you in here is where the coffee grounds get put into. Can you see that? Let's see okay, if you can see that. There we go. See, they're like little pods. So that goes into my compost. There's no, um, there's no plastic waste with this, right? That, that's what I love. Um, and down in here is the water. So I'm going to take this out after. And then I just put that into the sink. Okay. But isn't that cool? All right. So you can adjust how strong the coffee is. You can adjust your spout for small cups, right? Or larger cups. Like this glass is really tall, right? Um if you just want water, hot water for say a hot chocolate or something, that's what this is for. And you would go through the menu function and be able to just get the water, okay? Which is easy, actually I'll do it, right? Just to really reinforce, so I'm using, I'll just use this for the water, okay? All right, so I'm gonna go to menu, and I want to go down to drinks and I want to say yes drinks and I want hot water so I'm going to say yes and when I've had enough hot water I would press this button again okay and it's going to come out of here yep it's asking me did I put the spout in and I'm saying yes I did now it's going to do so it's it's foolproof it's foolproof but if you don't want to mess around with stuff in the morning it's just so simple very simple tasty your drinks are hot and there we go so here we go we've got some water maybe you're going to make tea or hot chocolate right now i've had enough water thank you can you see that steam right it's good and proper and hot it's not super loud. So anyway, if you're thinking about an automatic espresso maker, um, I, of course, I've had this one now for six, six weeks. I recommend it. It's doing really well for us so far. So um, again, it's a Philips and it's the 3100 series. Okay. Um, I purchased this. I, get, I think it's okay for me to see where say where I purchased it. I got it at Costco online, all right? So 
Um, again, the only review I could find on it was in German. I'm hoping that my English review will be helpful. I'm sorry, I did have a sound issue at the beginning of this video. Um, and if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to comment. Um, I'm, I'm not the greatest video maker, okay? But uh, I do love a good cup of coffee, I can tell you that. All right. So, again, here we go. Latte macchiato. Yummy, right? And it's still hot. This is the cappuccino. Nice and hot, too. This is cappuccino with espresso, right? Mm. Mm hmm. Very good. Okay, again, if you have questions, message me. Cleaning up is so simple, simple with this. Um, coffee beans going here. You can adjust the grind. Water goes in here. You can use filtered water if you want. It does come with a water filter, okay? It is in here. Um, when you get the machine, you'll have a test strip to test the hardness of your water and the machine will run you through each step on setting it up, okay? Like, so it's simple. You plug it in and it does it. So make sure you do the proper setup right when you've plugged it in, that you follow all the instructions and you have everything ready. Okay, anything else I can tell you? Oh, we love it. Um, I hope you will too. And uh, yeah, so that's all for now. Cheers.